Hello everyone, welcome back for more Let's Play Breath of Fire. Last time, we managed to get ourselves a Sky Key. And in doing so, managed to thaw the town here. Now since the town is thawed, there is a thing we can do right here. Okay, Rod 5 is still equipped. By fishing in this little pond with the good Rod, we get ourselves Dragon Armor. It's still not as strong as the Life Armor that we picked up earlier, so I won't be equipping it yet, but we will hang on to it because it is kind of important to hang on to. Meantime, we can look up here and see there's not a whole lot going on up here either. <laughs> but let's let's talk to a few people and see if the see if the town's the town has lost its mind apparently. Spring has indeed come. A hero fell into the falls. I guess that's your hint to go fishing around here with the best rod and pick up some armor. I guess that is your hint. Also, as soon as I picked up the controller and got everything set, my, my body decided it wanted to yawn a whole lot. It waited until that exact moment. Tunnel behind the waterfall leads to scanned. It might lead to scanned, but I will say this. It, it takes a little while to get to scanned. And we've got things we need to do beforehand. Yeah, the only thing you could do is help climb, huh? That that's your whole that's your whole existence. You would like to face back, but all you can do is climb. Yeah, still nothing here. Well, not much has actually changed around here. So, right now, we can, now that the water is thawed, we can actually go in here. This road may not lead directly to Scanned, but it actually will get us one step closer. One step closer being a very big step big in the fact that we're gonna spend we're gonna spend a little bit of time in the next area however this cave is fairly um, non noteworthy There really isn't much to this cave. There are no twists, no turns. Okay, there are turns, but it's still just one linear path. We make it to a staircase. We'll go here and basically just another linear path to the exit. So not, not a lot to talk about in this little section. Yeah. 
Yeah, as long as all the as long as all the zombie does is try to chew on us a little bit. It, it can chew on us a little as a treat. Which is the inverse of it actually turning us into a zombie, oddly enough. So now, we are over here on the world map. The next town we need to go to is on the map. But we got a little bit of walking to get there. There's not much up here. If you wanted to look around, there's not much here. And also, slimes are in this part of the world. So yeah, not much here. We walk a little bit further south though, and yeah, the enemies turn into things you would expect to see at this stage of the game. No, I don't want an antler. Antlers are largely um, useless for me now. They do one thing. One thing that I'm much better served just having just having a healer. Let's see, I believe we keep going down to the south. We will eventually get where we need to go. I'm going to get into this next town. If the game lets me. And then we're going to do a little bit of warping. Because we have reached the town of Carmen, and there's not much here of note yet. But we, we've got this, we've now got this as a warp spot. Now that we've warped. I'm going to do this, this may be a waste of time. I would like to think that it's not, but there is a chance it is a small waste of time at this moment. So I may be very mistaken about something. If I am mistaken, I will look for it, look for something off camera and then, um, no, good. This should be exactly what I need. Unfortunately, I have to revert, revert Karn. This with Oxen for it for a second. Apparently he didn't like punching these. There we go. We needed to get a sea nut. What does it do? Yeah, we'll find out soon enough. Ingredient for a tonic. That's all we know about it. Much like something else we've got. Much like something else we've got sitting right there. So now that we've done that, let's keep you there. It should have stayed in the menu, shouldn't it? So we're gonna put Puka back in together. Okay, and now. Now with something now with something in our hands. There are two things we need to worry about here. One is figuring out what's going on at Carmen.
And two, we, we need to get another item. Huh. Pe people are not moving. Pe people seem to be kind of stuck in place here. Got a ruby bracelet. That says what it does. Go ahead and see if we can. Yeah, we. I mean, we. Why not? It probably does something useful. I just don't remember what off the top of my head. But yeah, it looks like just about everybody in town is is kind of frozen, including the fountain. Okay, but there's one person walking around. No? Okay. Yeah? Ah, so you weren't here when whatever happened happened, huh? Nothing there. Hmm. Okay. Still nothing. So yeah, we we kind of even the smoke has stopped. Huh. So yeah, we kind of hit Carmen at a bad time. Something happened that has frozen it in place. Huh. Well, that that's not good for it. They said there was a tower off to the east, or specifically talk, which is a tower. That might have something to do with the problems these guys are facing. Before we head that way... I need to head to the south to see if I have access to something. Ooh, reuse at 30. Move at 25. But yeah, I need to head towards the south and see if I can do something. If I have access. Okay, good. I also have some. I also have an item I'm going to need fairly soon. I mean, not this video, probably. Be because we have a whole last dungeon to go through fairly soon. But. After we get to a certain point, there's a thing I'm going to need to do to make sure I don't just die due to a 5% chance. You're also going to get another thing while we're here. Just to save some just to save us a little bit of time later. Yeah, we want to go north here eventually, but right now we're gonna go south. A lot of prep work. I'm just saving myself some time later. I hope. Yeah, ruins of a town. So now, sadly, you got to revert again. And we need Ox back in front to punch more tree. Because fruit is right here. Unfortunately, only one is right here at this exact moment in time. I don't know if more would pop out if we were to hit things. But I think also on the shoreline that's over there to the... I think near Gust. Yeah, near Gust. There are some other trees you can hit for apples. I 
I obviously have not done that. And yes, I'm using I'm burning more magic on Karn here. Getting the fruit right now is not necessary, but will save me a will save me a little time. Yeah, I need to go south. I need to go further south here, just just to see if something's available. to the south because we'll need to know where this is eventually anyway Sadly, the fortress is right there in the way. And it's just it's just gonna kinda block our path. Sadly. Otherwise we could get a, the last thing we need for something in the future right now. As when it's convenient. Sadly. But we are we are not so lucky. Oh, I hate shock. I think now that we've done all the prep work we can do and sadly I don't have Bo in the party to do the hunting I need to there I think we're going to actually get to talk sadly we're gonna to have to revert Karn again to manage to make it yeah blue 39 Even more enemies and no shock. Not a fan of shock knowing enemies. I, I guess I've said that plenty, haven't I? aren't supposed to be in this area, I don't think. I mean, it's just kind of an inhospitable wasteland. Just feels like this is something governments, kingdoms, whatever you want to call it, would have said, don't go in there. Because we got enemies that no shock, it's an inhospitable wasteland. Terrible for farming. Can't imagine it's easy to do any ranching either. Eh, anyway. So there is what we need. Unfortunately, Puka does not have the ability to to uh, walk through forest like we need to right now. Bo does. Take 
few steps through the forest to the north, head east, and now we're in Talk Tower. Two things need to happen right now. One, we need to put you in front. Huh, second of all, let's go ahead and do this. Then we're going to need to go ahead and revert Puka. It, it will drain Karn. But... Why am I not stepping on those tiles? Well, right now it doesn't do me a whole lot of good to step on those tiles. It will soon. And we found nice, clean, clear water. Go ahead and recover our hit points because, well, I mean, we couldn't stop at the inn back, back in Carmen because the proprietor was frozen. So we had no way to heal ourselves there. No way to rest. So here is as good a rest point as any. And also it's a good point to stop the video, take a break. To work out these yawns that are building up. But yeah. Next time we we will actually explore Talk Tower and explore Talk Tower and explore Talk Tower. That will make sense later. But for now, taking a break. So until then, take care everyone.